We're giving out advice, guys. Okay. This is, like, advice people don't really, like... People give advice on Daybreak, right? But this is, like, a, for new players. This is all for new players. Basically. Like, people want to watch tutorials on how to loop and everything in Daybreak. Yeah. Okay, yeah. But, like, they want... I'm just going to stand here and do a free round so I can explain to you guys. But, basically... It's kind of an, it's kind of like a lot. Here's the thing. When people look up tutorials on how to loop, I don't think that they get that everybody has a different style when playing. So if somebody's saying watch tutorials to figure out how to loop, uh sure. Mm, yeah. Basically, you don't you do that, right? But everybody has a different play style. So since everybody has like a different play style, you really need to pay attention, honestly, if I'm being for real. You need to pay attention because everybody's different play style. Some people are meant for looping and some people aren't. And that is okay. We need to like normalize the fact that not everybody's meant to be a looper, bro. It's the truth too. It's the honest truth is not everybody is meant to be a looper. Not everyone is meant to be a looper. Some people like me, for example, I cannot loop to save my life, but I can gen rush beautifully. I can gen rush beautifully. But I can't loop. Uh, okay, let me tell you real quick. Advice for new players. Because a lot of people get... Like, I've noticed a lot of new players in the game recently in public servers. And so people are always saying, follow tutorials. Because they want advice and hints and everything. But, like, honestly, everybody has a different play style. You have to figure out yours. And that's honestly through experimenting with different players. Like, that's the, like, that's the best way I can say it. You need to experiment with different players. You need to play with different um, characters. Figure out what works best for you. Don't just play a looper the entire time because that's what you're used to. Get out of your comfort zone. For real. Like, I mean, so for real. Get out of your comfort zone. Don't be afraid to try something new. Like, really don't. Because, honestly, you're going to encounter evil people and mean people in servers all the time. But it's all about the fact you got to try. You got to just try. You can't stick to one character. You can't stick to one character. That's what you can't do. I'm t telling you right now, do not stick to one character when you first start out. Try all different types of characters. My best recommendation, here's how I learned. You play as every single character at least once or twice. Play as every single character in the game at least once or twice. But be sure, like, you're being self-aware at least. Play as every character once or twice so that way you know in, like what you do want and what you don't want. Because... A lot of the time, you're going to have different goals and what you want to do. You just got to, like, figure out what works for you the best, honestly. Oh, shoot. Okay, I was afraid I hit this guy. But, basically, like, that's it, though. Different styles. There's different styles. You might not be a looper. You might really want to be a looper because it seems like they get the most praise or credit or whatever. But not lo looping doesn't work for everybody. And that's the truth. Looping does not work for everybody. Some people might be better playing as... Gen rushers, they might be better at undetectable because when they're undetectable, they can save and do gens. Like I'm, not, like I'm better at being an undetectable and gen rusher. I'm not good at looping. I'm not really the best at stunning or saving. Like I can save, but saving is not my forte. I prefer to gen rush while others save. If the if the person is near me and I can save, I will save. But if you're strong, so if you know where your strong suit is, and you know where it lies, stick with. Like, sometimes you have to step out of your comfort zone and try different things. Don't be afraid to try. That's, like, the honest truth. You gotta try different characters. And, honestly, try different killers, too. When you try a killer, let me tell you right now. When you try a killer a lot, a lot of the time it's gonna focus on experience. So if somebody has more experience than you with the killer, no matter what, they're probably gonna kill you a lot of the time because they have more experience playing that killer. Like, I can, I play Banshee so long, and I could start off the round being terrible for me. Yeah, you can. But the round can start off terrible for me, but then it can become better. So basically, what I'm going to tell you right now, try your best, gain experience. Because you can't teach experience. You really can't. You have to try everything for yourself. I'm going to recommend trying all killers once. Because I asked somebody, what, like, do you play stalker? They're like, no, that's not my play style. You have different styles. Some people are better as stunners. Some people are better as loopers because they can distract. But it's honestly, it's not, it's like all about 
what works for you. So you can't go off of somebody else's experience and how somebody else plays when it's really not about how somebody else plays. It's about how you play and how like what works best for you. So I'm going to ask these guys real quick. Guys, okay. Do you, Okay, are y'all more of Jan Rushers or something else? Something else. Like Stunners. Stunner. Like, are you Jen Rushers? Are you Stunners? Uh, loopers. Like, why do you why do you play certain characters and like and not others? Like sometimes it, it can be so unrelated to the game though. I'm everything. See, some people can be, some people are everything, and it works out for them. I'm a gen rusher. Why are you a gen rusher? Some people are better at gen rushing. Some people, like, find most joy and fun in gen rushing. I like doing gens pe peacefully. I like looping with gen rushers. It's funny. <laughs> it really is. Looping can be stressful. It can be. It can. That's why I don't do it. I can't handle the stress. I can't handle the stress. And the stress of looping. It's like not looping is not for everybody though. Looping is not for everybody. Looping isn't for everyone. That's like looping isn't for everyone. It's the truth. Some people are better at gen rushing than they are at looping. Let's go over here though. I just do some gens and hope for the best. That's all you can do at this point. Looping has become a common thing for me. See, practice makes perfect. Now, if you're determined to become a gen rusher, you're going to be a gen rusher. Because, like, like not gen rusher, but looper. If you're determined to be a looper, you can do it, though. If you, you can do it. If you're determined. If you really want to determine to be a looper, you really want to be, like, the um, looper, the one that, like, distracts the killer and everything, that's perfect for you. Be the looper. Because at the end of the day, a lot of the time, that's going to work out in your favor. It really will work out in your favor. Because you keep practicing. Practice makes perfect. That's the saying, too. Practice makes perfect. Some, like some killers. Same with killers, though. If you play a killer enough, you get to recognize their patterns, their reaction time, and like their lunge, their cooldowns. So you memorize those things as you play them. So you have a better chance against certain killers if you play that killer a lot or get to know that killer that's like that's like my advice basically that's my advice the more experience you can't teach experience it's the truth you can't teach experience you can try but you can't teach experience as long as you like really want to do something you can do it think about it like if you want to be a looper, you suck at looping at first, get better at it. If you have friends that are practice looping with you, you can have friends that are practice looping with you, but, like, you, they got to be no mercy. They got to show no mercy, bro. They got to be brutal. Let's go to the gate. Gate time, guys. We got to go to the gate. Come on. Come on. You got to go to the gate. But, yeah, honestly. Also, you can't expect everybody to do the work for you. You got to pick up the slack. You got to try it all. You can't just stick to one thing because you, you got to step outside of your comfort zone. If you want to be comfortable, then don't expect to improve. If you didn't really improve, if you're still comfortable, really, honestly, you're going to get uncomfortable at times, but you got to, like, improve. It's all about improving. We're done. We're done with the game, though. That's fun. GG's, look at that XP. That's beautiful. That is beautiful, you guys. Basically, that's it. You can't teach experience. You can't. You can try, but you can't. That's it, though. I didn't get this. I didn't get level 10 Id prestige 10 idol by just doing nothing. I actually had to put in the work in public, public servers and a little bit in private servers. That's it, though. I'll see you guys in the next one. Shout out to these guys, too. They were, like, really helpful.